Hello everyone, my name is Okan and I'm a Creative Media and Game Technology student at Breda University of Applied Sciences. So I came into contact with Boaz through a friend. Uh, he knew I wanted to study games and he was already orienting in uh, bachelor studies and he was like, yo, there's a uh, game study in Breda, I want to check out the open day and that's how I came into contact with Boaz. So why I chose uh, Boaz for this degree is immediately when I came into the open day I saw that uh, all the projects that everyone was working on and the professional uh, experiences from the industry veterans that teach the students here at school and I immediately felt uh, welcomed and familiar with this environment so that's what, partially the reason why I chose this. Boaz Games, what in my own experience and also being told of other people's experience is that it is a really tight-knit community just like the gaming industry itself. The uh, cool thing here is that when I work with someone on a project or when I just see someone in class and interact with them, that means that also I have a chance to interact with them in the future in projects or other companies or uh, just networking in general. And that's the really the thing that's uh, interesting about this uh, education. Best Buas memory so far is um, back in the first year, in the first block, after a couple of weeks. Well, there was this moment where I like looked around and you see everyone working with games and everyone having fun and everyone uh, just working towards a future you also want to work towards and it was like this this moment where I really felt like you know I'm really here like I'm really working towards uh, my career in the gaming industry and that was my, like that would be my favorite moment. Teachers they seem scary for a lot of students especially because um, there's a lot of pressure on students here and they're the people who grade you but they're really cool people they're just like you and me they have been in the games industry they love games just as much as we do and they're here really to help us uh, help us develop further, achieve our goals and solve our problems and we uh, have basic just one-on-one -on -one sessions with the teachers uh, a couple of times throughout the block and they're always around, they're easily reachable through uh, Microsoft Teams or just shoot them an email and they're really cool people, they, they have fun just like you and me. <laughs> Working with people from different cultures, like myself, I have a different culture than uh, the standard Dutch culture. And for me it's easier because I already have like a wider spectrum of cultures. Um, but uh, it is, it helps uh, the environment and the project to work with different kinds of people because everyone has a certain box that they can think in and that someone from another culture or someone uh, from a different environment, they will have a different box and you can combine all those ideas or concepts or whatever to create something that you would not be able to when you only work with people from the same kind of box. So my advice for new students would definitely be already start familiarizing yourself with the, the discipline. So if you're going to be a designer, find out what game design is. A lot of students don't know what, like new students don't know what game design is. Watch some YouTube videos, read some books, already start uh, making games and uh, what's important is when you start making something, also uh, document your process because here uh, you will be more graded on your process rather than the end product. So if you come here with a game for your portfolio, have your process, have your what was my plan, what were the tools I used, and what are problems I faced, those kind of things are really important. I base my study choice and because of the open day. If you want to have more information about your orientation, go to buas.nl slash and I wish you good luck and I hope to see you soon.